Your Excellency, what impresses me in your leadership is the fear for God. Tumezoea wale ambao wakati wa kusherekea na kukaribisha mwaka mpya mimi sijawahi kuwa na hafla hapa lakini wale ambao huja sana walikuwa nanongonezea pale kwamba ni wachache wangeonda mwaka mpya manake vileo vingekuwa vimetembea sana hapa wachache wangeona 2023 But I can assure your excellency that all of us all of us are sober. Na kwa mapenzi ya Mwenyezi Mungu kila mtu ataona mwaka 2023. La pili What impresses me your excellency? I have been a governor in this region for 10 years. I have never been invited for such a function for those 10 years reason i was in the opposition but in your leadership you do not want to know whether a leader is in opposition or not as long as you're a leader you're willing to extend your hand to work with them your excellency as a region and as a leadership we are going to work with you we are going to walk with you we are going to pray with you for prosperity of this nation You are a true magnet. You are a true leader who na ubaguzi. And through your leadership tumejua kwamba kuna Mungu aishie mbinguni. If the miracles that happened in this country, your presidency is one of them. Where we could arise it should be seen as one of those miracles. Because your excellency hiyo kitu mekalia in this very same ground in this very state house in this very place we having dinner some instructions were issued that you should immediately not occupy the house that is neighboring this state house the house of the deputy president and yet you are the deputy president lakini kwa sababu mungu halali kwa sababu ya maombi today the chair those who sat on that chair to issue those instructions today you're the person occupying that chair that is a miracle and indeed is a testimony that there is a living god in heaven tunakuombea kila laheri ili usukume kenya mbele your excellency tunaingiza mwaka mpya na siku zote tarehe itakuwa si jambo lolote ikiwa kutoweza kutukumbusha kutukumbusha tunapotoka na kuweza kutufunza yale ya kuyafanya tunapoelekea katika haya yote ambayo tunaweza kuyasherekea ni lazima tusherekee tukiingia katika mwaka unaoingia panapo majaliwa mwaka 2023 tuwe ni wale tutakaojifunza kwa yale aliyopita ikiwa kuna lolote ambalo nilo kosefu ni njia gani sisi kuweza kulirekebisha ikiwa kuna njia lolote Lazuri liloweza kufanywa sisi tuweze kuliboresha zaidi na zaidi ili kesho na kesho kutwa wengine watakaobarikiwa katika ikulu hii kukiwa kuna rais mwingine baada miaka na gavana mwingine baada miaka na wao waweze kutuhukumu sisi ya kuwa wanajaribu kuliendeleza gurudumu la kuhakikisha utumishi kwa wakenya unaenda mbele na mbele na sio kuregea nyuma itakuwa hakuna tofauti yetu sisi na hayawani ikiwa hatutoangalia tarehe ikawa ni tarehe yenye kutufunza ya kwa leo tuko hapa kesho tunataka tuwe pahali gani pengine 
Your Excellency, viongozi uchaguliwa na Mwenyezi Mungu. Binadamu ni sababu. Kuna sababu kwa nini leo niko hapa Abdul Swamad mtoto wa Sharif Nasir kama gavana wa jiji la Mombasa. Kuna sababu kwa nini William Samoe Ruto ni rais wa Kenya. Yote haya ni mambo ya Mwenyezi Mungu. Lakini hakuna pacha bora zaidi katika uongozi kama pacha wale ambao hata kama mumetoka hamkufanana lakini nia ni moja na nitakuwa nimekosa kwa wana Mombasa your excellency ikiwa sitowaambia yale tuloweza kunongonengezana pamoja tumezungumza na nina imani ya kuwa ukija utayazungumza zaidi ya kuwa Mombasa juzi tumeanza program tukachukua vijana elfu mbili katika kazi za mitaani Mombasa yangu program na ukaniambia gavana ya kwa, kwa kila kijana mmoja unayemchukua the central government is matching one extra person vijana waweze kupanda miti tuweze kuboresha mji wetu ikiwa fikra maoni yatakuwa haya kufanana utakuwa si uongozi mwema kwa hivyo your excellency mimi nitakuwa si msemaji sana mimi nikuchukua fursa na nimemuomba tayari first lady na amenikubalia ya kuwa leo na kesho atazungumza na wewe kwa makini kwa kina sana na tumekubaliana ya kuwa panapo majaliwa upige kaa wiki moja nyingine hapa katika Mombasa Your Excellency the first lady hili joto ni la leo peke yake kwa vile watu ni wengi usijali usijali Wana Mombasa na wa Kenya kwa jumla happy new year Asanteni sana Mimi nataka niwaambie ninyi mlio hapa na wale wote wa Kenya walio sehemu mbalimbali za taifa letu la Kenya happy new year happy 2023 natazamia kufanya kazi na nyinyi wote kushughulika na mambo ya Kenya pamoja na wakenya wote na sote tuweze kuchangia mahali ambapo tunaweza kiasi ambayo tunaweza katika kusukuma kurudumu la taifa letu liende mbele kwa sababu hapo ndipo uwezo wa kila mmoja wetu unahitajika